Slaughterhouse Island trashed by more than a thousand college students. I think it's unfortunate. It sucks that, you know, uh, people trash the place. Tents, dozens of empty alcohol bottles and other garbage left behind. The U.S. Forest Service estimates young people on more than 60 houseboats came to this island and didn't pick up after themselves. I don't know how so that many tents got left at, at the Shasta area. Um, that's a lot to be left there just to just abandon them, but I, there's no way that's going to happen this weekend. The Forest Service says the University of Oregon is likely to blame for leaving the big mess. They're invited to play in our backyard, but it would be nice if they would be a little bit more you know, common courtesy, show some responsibility. I'm going to Lake Shasta and going on a houseboat. Um, just typical UC Davis um, Greek life. UC Davis students say the Memorial Day weekend getaway is a big tradition and hundreds of them will be on houseboats at Shasta Lake. I would never expect that to be repeated in any circumstance by any other university. The university has encouraged students to party responsibly. I would say like, you know, clean up your mess. Uh, I don't know, handle yourself, uh, be safe, um, don't get too drunk. Some fraternity brothers say they've already assembled a group to clean up before they make it back home on Monday. We'll be good. It's never been an issue like as far as trashing the place. Uh, we always make sure we like clean it up um, just because it's like, I don't know, it's just it's an environment that we like love to be around and like going to like a dump isn't always like the best thing to do, you know. Here along Fraternity Row, fraternities and sororities say they have every intention of respecting Shasta Lake. They don't want to ruin their good reputation. In Davis, Leticia Ordaz, KCRA 3 News.